Welcome back. Each fall, Architectural Digest releases its fashion issue filled with the breathtaking homes of some of the biggest names in the industry. The issue on newsstands now includes a peek inside the gorgeous homes of some of fashion's A-list, including Tommy Hilfiger, Stephen Klein, Carlos Souza, and Isaac Mizrahi, just to name a few. Architectural Digest Editor-in-Chief Margaret Russell takes us on a tour of Isaac's stunning Greenwich Village apartment. I'm Margaret Russell, I'm the Editor-in-Chief of Architectural Digest magazine, and I'm here today with my friend Isaac Mizrahi. Three apartments put together, it took 20 years, yes. what a story. I know, I moved in 20 years ago and lived in the one bedroom for quite a long time and then I acquired the studio and then I got this place in between and put it all together and I think it flows very well. So this is such a big square room and I love how you've divided it up. I want to have a lot of flexibility mm -hmm. in the room so everything has to be like able to move to the side like that table tilts up and it moves out if you want. And that's why I kept it kind of neutral mm -hmm. and kind of mobile. And texture is almost being used as a color. That's right. And all of them next to each other I think are quite fascinating. And I love how it corresponds to your kitchen, which is such a brilliant space. You want to go look? Yes. Okay. So this is the kitchen. Again, a quite white room. I guess that's my theme. And very good to cook in. You have things from all different periods, like Asian and yeah. English and beautiful. I know. I love it. And I need more. <laughs> <laughs> Should we continue? Yes. Okay. So this is the den. I use it for reading. And also, if I have people, it's great because after dinner they can come in here. It started with this rug. I designed this rug. Is this one of your fabrics? Yes, it is. It's an exploded chintz. I designed fabrics for the place that I would like to live. And I use a lot of them. I mean, I, that's my fabric, mm -hmm. this is my fabric, and that too, that kind of leopard petty point. I heard you do this great thing with the curtains in your bedroom. Oh, I did. You want to see? I do. Okay. God, Isaac, your closet is so organized. And I found more color in this white apartment. It's in your tie collection. I know, I have a lot of tie. They're really bright. I know. So this room is like a tree house with all the it vines is. on the That's trellis right. around. And then you can also just black everything out. These are the curtains you were asking about. These are sort of like silk canvas from you know, Isaac Mizrahi, and then this is Maharam, and it's just this felt. And they're perfect blackout curtains. They're perfect, like the room is so dark in the morning, you wouldn't believe it. That is so genius, I'm gonna steal that idea. <laughs> I think this is my dream bath. It's a great bathroom. It's three rooms, it was like a kitchen and a, a dining room, and then a little bathroom, which we put all together into one big. And this room opens right onto the terrace. That's right, yes. but look at the that. Window, the window, this look is amazing. That. It's so cute, right, it's very James Bond. And also, it's a great little space for things like yoga and massages. Isaac, this has been such a treat. This place is filled with ideas and inspiration. I loved every inch of it. Well, thanks a million for coming, and I have some wine on the terrace. Okay, great.